Hey, it's JC here. JC's Comics and More, your pop culture superstore at 6725 West Central Avenue. That is Toledo, Ohio. 43617 419 531 JC's Comics and More at Hotmail.com. You can find the Facebook uh, uh, information in the description below. I just picked up a very small group of comics uh, a few days ago. And we'll run through what they are. There's going to be a lot of comics in here that are going to be dollar comics, like this Action Comics, for instance. You can certainly you know, come into the shop or you know, contact me. Uh, but a lot of dollar comics, as some of these just aren't in the greatest of shape. There are some rusted staples and some other, uh, other things to uh, make them not gem mint. Not CGC quality books to get slapped. But here we got Amazing Spider-Man 204. Ambush Bug 1, 3, we got Batman the Outsiders, several of these, in issue 1, 3, 4, 5, that's crossover with the new Teen Titans, which we do have that issue in the Teen Titans stack, we've got 6, we've got 7, or 12, great Jim Apparel artwork, we've got 13, 14, 15, at 18, 19, we got 20, a 21, 22, 23, 24. Uh, a lot of those uh, Batman and the Outsiders will be dollar issues, as well like this issue of Cloak and Dagger. Uh, but we got issues one, two, three. We got four. We got issue one of the short ongoing series. We got two DC Comics presents 83, uh, two copies of Superman and Batman and the Outsiders. A run of Flash to Carmen Infantino and I think Carrie Bates. A Carrie Bates run uh, 323 Flash versus Flash versus uh, the Reverse Flash. That's where uh, Flash kills the Reverse Flash. 324, 325, 326. 327, the Justice League of America uh, decide to vote him out or not. Uh, 328, this is a reprint of uh, the marriage of Iris West uh, uh, and uh, uh, Barry Allen. Uh, 328, you got 329, 330, 331, 335, 336, 337, 338, 340, uh, 342. That's going to be a dollar issue. Uh, 343. Uh, some of these are uh, do have some beds in them, which can be certainly pressed out. Uh, 344, 345, 346, 347, 349. I'm going to pause this quickly and get the next group over. Got the first issue of the six uh, four issue miniseries, Johnny Thunder, number one. We get issue number two. Then we go to, we've got all six of the Kitty Pride and Wolverine. We'll probably sell this as a complete set. There's two, there's three, there's four, there's five, there's six. Here we got Marvel Fanfare. Uh, this has a Cloak and Dagger story in it. Uh, here we have Marvel Superhero Secret Wars number five. Uh, number six, number eight, we've got number 10, 11, 12, Marvel Tales, first appearance of Peter Porker, the Spectacular Spider-Ham, and also Hawk Buddy, Captain America, and the Goose Rider. Here we've got Marvel Team-Up Annual number six with Spider-Man, Cloak and Dagger, and the New Mutants, early appearances for all. We're going to pause this again. Next up, big old stack of Marv Wolfman and George Perez's New Teen Titans, issue one. Unfortunately, no DC Comics presents number 26, but we have issue one there. Issue two, first appearance of Deathstroke the Terminator. Let's see if we can zoom in on that a little bit. First appearance of Deathstroke the Terminator there. Uh, we've got issue three. Got four, 
with them uh, with the Justice League versus the Justice League of America. Uh, number five, number six, Trigon the Terrible. I think he makes his first appearance. This is Kurt Swan artwork. Gave George a a, uh, a break, but there's Trigon's uh, first appearance by Kurt Swan, not by George Perez. George created them, but uh, Kurt drew uh, drew him for the first time. There's issue six. We've got seven, Dr. Light, and you get to see the first origin of Cy, uh, Cyborg. Issue nine, Day in the Lives. Very, 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 very good. Uh, number nine, ten, second appearance of uh, Deathstroke the Terminator. Issue 11. We've got 12, Clash of the Titans. Uh, number 13, uh, the quest for the killers of the Doom Patrol. Uh, we've got, we're missing 14. We've got 15. We've got 16. Uh, first appearance of Captain Carrot and the Amazing Gru, uh, his Amazing Zoo crew. We've got 17. 18. We've got 19. Guest starring Hawkman. We've got 20. We've got 21. First appearance of Brother Blood. Also, first appearance of Night Force by Marv Wolfman and Gene Colan. There's 22. 23. We've got 24. 25. 26 is the first appearance of Tara. She makes her first appearance in there. Taking on Changeling. Gar Logan. Changeling. Uh, I've got 27. These two issues here, Marv and um, George dealt with. Something that you see in the news a lot, like, like, uh, a lot lately. Uh, runaways, uh, teenage sex slaves uh, being used as mules and stuff like that. Powerful 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 story a uh, 16 page preview for a Tory force Atari force that uh, fully brings Terra into the Titans world as she takes on the Titans themselves and not just scar we've got 29 speedy is back uh, 30 Terra joins the Teen Titans we've got 31 32 we've got 33 34 again the Terminator shows up uh, 35, 36, 37, that's the crossover with uh, Batman and the Outsiders. We've got 38, trying to go in and retell the Donna Troy story. 39, uh, Wally Rest, West and uh, Dick Grayson uh, give up their uh, identities as Kid Flash and Robin. Uh, 40, 41. 41 is, of course, going to be a dollar comic. A lot of these Titans are going to be dollar comics. Some will not, of course. 42, part one of uh, the Judas Contract. 43. Uh, 44, the first appearance of Nightwing and Jericho. And, of course, you've got the Terminator Deathstroke in there. We've got 45. Uh, and then also, I guess I should go back and point out that... Uh, issue 41, the title changes from the new Teen Titans to Tales of the Teen Titans. As a new, I believe it was Baxter Paper or Mandu Paper uh, Teen Titans series started. That was uh, direct shops only. Uh, but we've got 45. We've got Aqualad and uh, uh, Aquagirl there. We've got 46, 47. We've got a couple of 48s here. 49 with Dr. Light, 50, The uh, Marriage of Donna and Terry, 51, 52, Rich Buckler doing the art on the inside, George doing the art on the outside, there's Annual 1, Annual 2, the first appearance of uh, Chase as the new vigilante, and that's the finale to uh, uh, Judas Contract. Uh, we've got issue, ah, there was a 53 that was out of, out of place, uh, 53, 54, uh, 55, 
some great uh, covers here. A couple of 55s, uh, 56, both a newsstand and a direct market edition. 57, Cyborg Human, 57, you got 58, 59, or no 59, you got 61, they seem to jump around here, 62, 63, 64, Brian Ballon covers, 65, 66, we got 67, there was a Perez cover, 68, a Barry Windsor Smith cover, 70, that's a rare Steve Bissett cover, 71, 75, and 79. We'll pause this again. Here's a run of that uh, Teen Titans, uh, new Teen Titans series I was telling you about. That's the first issue, again, on much better paper stock than the newsprint. But there's two, there's three, five, six, seven. George doing different covers, doing some colored covers. Uh, number nine. There's a 10, there's an 11, there's a, uh, I think this was a 7, but this is, what, what issue was this? This is water damage, so this is going to be a buck. So I can't, I think that's issue, whatever issue I was missing. Um, and then we've got the annual to uh, New Teen Titans. There we've got Peter Porker, Spectacular Spider-Ham. His own series, we've got issues one, two, and three. And look, uh, Shan Gula, uh, Spider-Man, uh, Peter Parker, Spectacular Spider-Man number 70, an early Cloak and Dagger variant parents, unfortunately not their first appearance. But we've got 81 and 82 also, Red Tornado number one of a four issue miniseries, Carmen Infantino artwork, but that's the only issue of that series. Sergeant Rock number 396. Um, Star Trek number one from Gold Key. Unfortunately, the back cover is missing. So uh, if you'd like to have a copy, you've got a copy, but it's certainly not a real collectible copy. But it's going to be pretty damn cheap. Uh, I've got the Star Trek here. Issue number nine. And they... Instead of having red shirts, for whatever color reason, they colored them with lime, lime green shirts. But that's number nine. I believe this is issue ten. Gold Key never put their uh, numbers on the front. It's number ten from May of 1971. This would be eleven. This would be twelve. And then that's it as far as the try Star Trek issues. That's uh, Supergirl, the official. Adaptation of the movie. We've got a photo uh, on the back. Superman number 417. Superman The Secret Years. These have Frank Miller covers. This is the four issue series. All four issues are here. This will be sold as a set. Uh, Tales of the New Teen Titans. This is a four issue series also. Um, I have all four of these issues. This will be sold as a set also. Here we've got another copy of Uncanny X-Men and the New Teen Titans uh, crossover. This is the new stand edition. Pretty clean copy there. Untold uh, Legend of the Batman. This was a three-issue series. Uh, John Byrne um, did some of the artwork. This is uh, Jim Apparel and John Byrne and Jim Apparel. So I believe this was John Byrne's first DC work there. Uh, but issues one, issue two, I don't think did John do. Uh, Jim Apparel took over. John just did the first issue. So one, two, and three. V. Uh, the based on the TV series got one, two, and three. And the only other thing I really have is I think this must have come with uh, maybe action figures or something. He Man and She Ra, Secret of the Sword. A little mini comic there that we have 
it does have water damage there but this will also be for sale so if you do have uh, any questions or anything certainly let me know and uh, if you've not subscribed to the channel yet please subscribe it helps the channel please like the uh, videos please share the videos and you guys looking forward to any of these comics anybody want to try to snake any of these comics you know is it uh guys from flint or arkansas or pittsburgh or kentucky or rochester uh maybe erie pennsylvania uh, you know i've got lots of people outside of this toledo area here that snag these books up too so don't hesitate and hope everybody has a great new comics wednesday this week and a great thanksgiving thanks for watching